What's up everybody Aditya Mahajan here and welcome back to yet another YouTube video. So in today's video we'll be solving yet another easy lead code problem problem number 1295 also called as find numbers with even number of digits. So it states that we are given a vector uh, or an array called as nums of integers and we need to return how many of them uh, are containing even number of digits. For example if we take a look at the example uh, our nums vector has following numbers and we need to count how many digits are present for each number. Now if if that uh, number has even number of digits then we need to increment the counter and we need to return the total number of, number of numbers which have even number of digits okay for example this has two digits this has three this has one this has one and this has four so basically we have uh, two numbers which are having even number of digits that is 12 and 7896 so our output would be two Similarly, if you take a look at the second example, uh, in the second example, we just have uh, one number which has four digit, rest of them we have three digit, which is why we just return output to be one. Now for solution, it is pretty simple. What we'll be doing is we'll be iterating through the nums vector that we are given. And for every number, we would be checking how many digit it has. Now, if the total number of digits for that number is even in that case, we increment the counter and we just return at the end of the for loop, how many numbers we have. now. To check how many uh, if the number of digits are even we keep on dividing by 10 and we keep on incrementing the digits okay so for example uh, for the code you can take this one we have created an even count which would basically be our final answer that will be returning now we are iterating through the nums vector that we are given and while iterating we are taking every number and we are checking how many digits are there uh, in that particular number so one iteration would be checking that particular number and how many digits are there so we are creating a variable called as digits and we are uh, iterating uh, with the file loop while the number is greater than zero so every time what we are doing is we are dividing the number by 10. So for example, our number is 345. So in first iteration, uh, we divided by 10, then five would be gone. Our reminder would be 34. In second iteration, uh, four would be gone and our reminder would be, uh, and our number would be three. And finally, uh, three also would be gone and our number would be zero. So uh, the total number of digits will get to be three. So this would happen for all the numbers. And after that, what we are checking is we are checking if uh, the total number of digits that are coming up are even or not. If they are even, we are incrementing the even count. And at the end of the for loop, we are just returning that. So that's all for this video, guys. Uh, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up button. If you need more such lead code content, subscribe to the channel. And that's all. I'll see you in the next one.